Hey guys, what's going on? It's Lisa from TwoCreatorWebsite.com. I might sound a little different to you. You might have to adjust your volume. Wanted to tell you guys first Happy New Year and uh, let you guys know what's going on with me. I had thyroid surgery about three weeks ago. And unfortunately, during the surgery, my left vocal cord was paralyzed. I had a cyst, thyroid cyst, and it was benign, so, you know, that was the, the uh, most important thing. I'm glad it was not cancerous. But my vocal cord was definitely damaged, and I will be hoarse for, you know, some time. Now, I know this sounds, um, sounds, you know, oh my gosh, it's so horrible. But if you could have heard me three weeks ago, actually, you couldn't have heard me three weeks ago. My voice has gotten a little bit better every day since the surgery. So at first they, they told me it'd be about six months before it came back. Then they said it's likely two to three. Um, but if you could hear the progress that I've had, that I've made, you know, I think it'll probably be back in probably less than a couple of months fully. So I feel just extremely blessed that I'm able to talk this well, considering how I sounded. It was funny because when I woke up from surgery, the first thing I remember is the doctor's leaning against my bed. And he asked me, he said, is that your normal voice? And I'm like, did I sound like this two hours ago before surgery? No, this is not my normal voice. And so they went in, came back, brought in some vocal box or whatever. And that's when they discovered that my vocal cord was not moving. And this is actually something that's happened to quite a few people. Um, and uh, most people recover fine. It just takes some time. So I just wanted to come on and say Happy New Year. And let you guys know what's going on with me. So if you don't see a video for a couple of weeks, that's why I'm letting my voice heal and recover. Um, I also wanted to kind of remind you guys to not take so much for granted. You know, that's one reason I'm not sitting at my desk. I wanted this video to be a little bit more personal. So I'm in my bedroom today. Don't worry, I'm going back to my desk. But um, on a more personal note, this whole incident has sort of reminded me to not take so much for granted in life. And while I'm sure many of you guys have goals to make more money in 2011, don't forget what's really important, your health, your family. I have, I have a wonderful family that, you know, nursed me back to health when I was recovering from the surgery. Um, so that's really, at the end of the day, what's important. I mean, let's keep our goals. Let's keep striving to make money. But in 2011, if you need a resolution, try forcing yourself to uh, count your blessings. And uh, let's not take so much for granted in life. I never thought I'd wake up and not be able to be heard unless I'm standing within three feet of somebody, you know? And it was a really scary thing for me three weeks ago when I could barely talk. I was barely above a whisper. So the fact that I sound this well or this good um, in just three weeks is very encouraging to me. So I just wanted to come on and say hi, Happy New Year, let you guys know what's going on with me and to remind you to don't take so much for granted in life. Count your blessings. Um, if you're bummed out about your job and you want to quit your job and be able to do this, what I'm doing, be grateful you have a job because a lot of people in this economy don't. 10% of you guys watching do not have a job. So um, be grateful that you can speak, that you can be heard when you talk. Um, Sometimes it's easy to get down on, on yourself because of life, but um, there's a whole lot to be grateful for. So I wanted to remind you of that and uh, just say Happy New Year and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.